You know, I said today that we wanted to get together here, talk about how we have to protect health care for all in New York City. So we put out a message. We sent up a kind of bat signal to leaders and voices of conscience all over the city, and we did pretty well, my friends. We have Harry Belafonte here. Somewhere there, okay. Let's win, let's win. So, I want to talk about the crisis we face and what we need to do about it. Huh? 86 years ago, I was born of immigrant parents in the greatest city in the world, New York. The workers and the immigrants of the people of this city fought and worked hard throughout the years to open up hospitals, to open up health care systems, to focus on the needs of those who were disenfranchised and those who needed that health care in their lives for themselves and their children. Health care is not a privilege that comes to us from the rich. Health care is not something that is given us at the benevolent estate. Health care is a human right. Yes. It's a civil right. Now, in a neighborhood, what do you have? You have your deli, you have your dry cleaners, you have a church, you have a school, you have a synagogue if you're lucky, and you have a hospital. Now, what happens when that hospital is taken away? Now, it's true some of these hospitals have not been handled properly in terms of their economic life, but seriously, we can bail out Wall Street and we can't do that. hospital gone, which had its problems, I admit it, but I saw births there, I saw people die there. This was the hospital in this area that you went to. After 9-11, this is where everyone gathered to get blood, was that St. Vincent. Here are the facts. Hospitals all over the city in danger. Health care for people in danger. Health care is not something you can provide far away. Health care has to be in your neighborhood. The emergency room can't be too far away or it may be too late. It's a city of 8.4 million people and every one of them is depending on us as leaders to make sure that health care is readily available for them.